Hello and welcome to another episode of Graco Garage. In today's episode I'll be showing you how to update the software on your Invisipack from a USB drive. It is important when doing this software update that we have a token available. Since the software update process writes the software from the USB file to the token and then from the token to the system. For this update, you will need the Graco software file. That file will have a .gti file extension at the end of it. Now once we have the USB drive, the token, and the correct software, we first want to disconnect the power, turning off that main screen. Then we remove the advanced display module from its bracket, set it down in a safe location. Next we're going to need to remove the token access cover using a 2.5 millimeter Allen wrench. To begin the software update, we're going to navigate to the setup screens by pressing the lock button in the bottom middle of the keypad. Then we're going to navigate to the advanced chapter, page 4. Here on the screen we can see that there is a red X. That red X is indicating that not all of the software versions on the different components are the same revision. To update that software, we're going to press the button in the bottom left hand corner. We're then going to disable the USB download by pressing the button on the left hand side so that when we press put the USB into the ADM it doesn't automatically start a software download. Then we're going to insert our USB drive in the bottom of the ADM. That's going to look for the software file on the USB drive. Now it's showing us that it found software and it's waiting for the token to be installed in the ADM. So I'm going to take my token, plug that into the token slot. Now I can see my software revision here. We've got the current software file with a .gti file extension. That is the only software on this USB drive. Now to initiate that transfer, press the button in the bottom right hand corner and we start the file transfer. This file transfer may take several minutes. Please be patient. Once the software update is complete, we want to press the button in the bottom right hand corner. This will restart the machine. We wrote software from the USB drive to the token. Now that the Invisipack is restarted with fresh software on the token, it is loading that software from the token onto the Invisipack. Now that the software has been loaded off of the token onto the Invisipack, uh, we can see those green check marks there saying that the token wrote software correctly. Now we press this button in the bottom right. The machine will restart one more time. Now we do not see the token icon in the bottom left hand corner. This tells us that it looked at the token and the software version on the token matched all of the internal software on the Invisipack. And so it's booting like normal. Now that we've booted to the home screen, we can pull the USB drive out and we can pull the token out. And then we can navigate back to the advanced chapter, screen 4, and we can see that the software part number and version numbers all match. 
So you can make sure that the uh, USB downloads are enabled and our Invisipack is ready to run. All right, guys, great job today. We've got the new software installed on the Invisipack system. So with that, we'll see you next time in another episode of Graco Garage. Yeah.